so good morning everyone fourth unit uh, lens of plane cars volume and surfaces of revolutions so deeniki sambandhinchina introduction topic ikkada chuddam so this is all about uh, unit 4 sem 1 sem 1 unit 4 okay so in this i will explain just important questions what we need for examination only for uh, short answer question and the long answer question first part okay so let us see let us start our uh, introduction part before going to start introduction part uh, subscribe my channel uh, see the video till the end okay so what is the rectification now write the expression to evaluate it so here we need to know rectification what is rectification write expression to evaluate it here we have a methods and here we have a process different uh, forms of plane curves to find the length of an arc uh, this is uh, process of finding length of an arc of a plane curve is defined as rectification so so this total chapter is on about uh, to find lens of a plane curve and surfaces of revolutions all right so in the chapter name itself we have lens of plane curves volumes and surfaces of revolutions okay so length of, lens of plane curves means so rectification the process of determining the lens of arc of the plane curves is defined as rectification right so rectification means the process of determining the lens of arc of the plane curves is defined as the rectification okay so the expression for length of arc for different forms of plane curves is given below so ikkada rectification ante ఏదైనా ఒక ప్లేన్ కర్వ్ లెంత్ ఫైండ్ అవుట్ చేయడమే రెక్టిఫికేషన్ అనమాట సో ఈ లెంత్ ఆఫ్ ప్లేన్ కర్వ్స్ ఫైండ్ అవుట్ చేయడానికి మనకు కొన్ని ఫార్మ్స్ ఉన్నాయి డిఫరెంట్ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ ప్లేన్స్కి డిఫరెంట్ టైప్స్ ఆఫ్ ఫార్మ్స్ ఉన్నాయి వాటిని చూద్దాం ఇక్కడ ఇఫ్ ద గివెన్ క్వశ్చన్ ఈజ్ ఇన్ క్వాటిషియన్ ఫామ్ ఇఫ్ ద గివెన్ క్వశ్చన్ ఈజ్ లైక్ వై ఈజ్ ఈక్వల్ టు ఎఫ్ ఆఫ్ ఎక్స్ హౌ వీ హౌ టు ఫైండ్ లెంత్ ఆఫ్ దిస్ ఎఫ్ ఆఫ్ ఎక్స్ బై యూజింగ్ దిస్ ఫార్ములా సీ ద లెంత్ ఆఫ్ ది ఆర్క్ ఆఫ్ ది కర్వ్ along x axis along x axis between two points whose abscissa are a abscissa are a and b is given by y is equal to sorry s is equal to integral a to b under root 1 plus dy by dx whole square so up to here we know we for up to here we know in the third unit we have up to here for that we are integrating then you will get length of an arc of the car i okay clear now if the given question is like x is equal to f of y then the formula to find length of the arc of the curve is s is equal to integral c to d under root 1 plus dx by dy whole square into dy okay so here e is c and d are the what ordinates of r c and d so if we take a point a comma b here a is what abscissa and b is what ordinate means ante ee formula lo ee a and b enti ante x ekka nunchi ekkadiki change avutundi ani cheppede ee a to b mari ikkada enti ante y anedi a point nunchi a point ki change avutundi ani cheppedi ikkada unna ordinates anamata so ikkada manam teesukovalsina limits enti ante y changing y ekka nunchi ekkadiki change avutundi anedi ikkada teesukuntam here we will take from x way to way changing here we will take as limits okay so here c and d are the y changings okay now if the question is in parametric form means if the question is like this x is equal to x of theta and y is equal to y of theta are the two curves drawn between two points alpha and beta as uh, as uh, their parametric values then the length of arc of the curve is given by given as integral alpha to beta okay alpha and beta are the two points he will give in the question integral alpha to beta under root dx by d theta o square plus dy by d theta o square into d theta is the formula to find length of an arc of a parametric curves okay if the given curves given curve is like polar form means r is equal to f of theta how we have to find length of the arc arc between the two points theta 1 and theta 2 integral s is equal to integral theta 1 to theta 2 under root r square plus dr by d theta o square into d theta okay if theta is equal to f of r if the given question is like theta is equal to f of r 
then the length of arc arc of the car between the two points r1 and r2 is given by this is equal to integral r1 to r2 under root 1 plus r d theta by dr whole square into dr so these are the formulas to find length of the arc of a given curve okay length of the arc of say arc of a given curve if the given curve is like a polar form we have two formulas if the given curve is like a parametric form we have a formula if the given curve is like a cartesian form we have here two formulas okay i hope all you clear so write it uh, on your notes and we will start problems from to from sorry to not tomorrow from monday we will start the problems based on this formulas okay i hope all you clear thank you thank you for watching have a nice day